So let's move on to our last game, which is Think About It. Think About It is a game where I'm going to give each team a question. They will answer the question one word at a time, back and forth between teammates. They will have 60 seconds on the clock to come up with an answer for the, for the question. The twist is, is that anytime they hear the bell, the other team... <laughs> The other team gets an opportunity to interject with a word and the team has to continue on using that word in their answer and so on and so forth. Does that make sense, Matt? I wasn't listening again. Good. <laughs> We're going to start off with you guys on this one, uh, team my team. Let's find out what your question is. Hmm. How to teach a kid oh. about the birds and the bees. So, Chris, you have a lot of experience in this, so I want you to bring that to this game, okay? I mean sex, Chris, just FYI. <laughs> uh, uh, Don't teach him, okay? Uh, so six days on the clock. We'll start off with Matt. One word at a time. Ready, set, go. First, you need them to listen and uh, touch <laughs> everything <laughs> that uh, moves in uh, your minivan <laughs> because uh, it will shiver oh. <laughs> asexually <laughs> your <laughs> <laughs> Um, gearbox. So you should. So I you get the last word in their thing. <laughs> so you should. <laughs> so you should. Yeah, I think that's a good end. Yeah, I think we all learned a little something. I think they should yeah. integrate that into like the sex education learned talks. Nothing. I learned nothing. Make I learned your... a lot about Kirk as a minivan. That's what I learned. <laughs> should make your gearbox shiver asexually. <laughs> <laughs> I like you brought asexual into a sexual discussion. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, isn't that like oxymoronic? To <laughs> <laughs> yeah, it's a little bit. We got a little bit off track there. This is what you don't do. <laughs> Let's read that out and see how that turned out. First, you need them to listen and touch everything that moves in your minivan because it will shiver asexually. Your gearbox, <laughs> so you should. <laughs> <laughs> we, yeah, it started off well. I don't know if it landed at the end there, but I think I think there was some. It's a complicated it. discussion. It yeah. is. Yeah. yeah, it's one of those things. I don't think there is a wrong answer, but right. if there is yeah. a wrong answer, we might have found it. <laughs> um, it's a positive message, though. Mm -hmm. You should be a caring lover. You should listen to someone before you shiver your gearbox in the minivan. Yeah, yeah. yeah. sexually. It's empowering. <laughs> No cookies. <laughs> no. <laughs> Not a single cookie. That's yeah. That's stage two of the lessons. Right. <laughs> Let's find out what uh, who the hell is this guy's uh, question is. How to write the next big pop song? Ready for this, Bernie? Absolutely. You this start is, with me. This is your moment. Oh, you got it. Okay. Start off with Bernie. Six seconds on the clock. Ready, set, go. Well, you need a big fulcrum <laughs> in order to pivot. Asexually. <laughs> Your emotions musically must uh, titillate your audience. <laughs> Are they, is that an audience in an Audi? Uh, uh, <laughs> in order to perpendicular <laughs> integration is very key to <laughs> all huge vasectomies. <laughs> so don't listen to anything that these <laughs> period, <laughs> period. <laughs> that these uh, these <laughs> You managed to turn anything into two words. I did, I did. <laughs> That's uh, the Oxford anything. Yeah. <laughs> Very academic on On the Spot. Thank you. Yeah. Um, 
I, I think that's how Taylor Swift writes her songs. Yeah, absolutely yeah. she does. She I, has a I, perpendicular I, vasectomy. <laughs> that's fulcrumed by a, uh, something. We Please. have a very broad vocabulary on this show. I'm really impressed. Listen, every good music career needs to pivot at some point. <laughs> yeah. You know? All right, let's read. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, did. you know, like like uh, Van Gogh cut off his ear, and there's other things you can cut in yeah. order to, you know. It, yeah, I just want to see where he's going with that. <laughs> in order to what? <laughs> let's I read agree. the sentence. <laughs> well, you need a big fulcrum in order to pivot asexually. Your emotions musically must titillate your audience. <laughs> In order, to, in order to perpendicular integration is very key to all huge vasectomies, so don't listen to anything that these hear you. Yeah, there was Drake. <laughs> that was the Drake. Shout out to Drake. I'd, I'd like to point out the best words in there is from us. They yeah, were. They kind of were. Don't they definitely words. were. It, we were just trying to finish our uh, birds and bees talk. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Vasectomies yeah. and perpendicular yeah. for You're sure. You're gonna teach, talk, <laughs> talk about like doing intro to science over there. <laughs> um, God, that's really tough to pick an answer. Uh, it's not that tough to talk. <laughs> All right, points to Matt. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> You know, if you win, you have to come back next week. You know, that's a rule, right? I changed that rule. <laughs> <laughs>